The AIDS-AS firm in Germany came to MacPress for a solution to the problems of baling and wrapping RDF waste. MacPress offers balers specifically designed to bale commercial and solid waste. Currently, the Mac L series balers are the only high-density, high-capacity horizontal balers designed for baling solid waste. Solid waste is one of the most difficult materials to bale due to the high range of materials in the waste stream. A very heavy-duty, well-constructed baler is required for this task. The Hardox bolt-on replaceable liners are essential for baling this difficult, corrosive, and abrasive material. The L-Series solid waste balers by MacPress allow all the liners in the compaction and extrusion chambers to be replaced. The wire tying unit is also specifically designed for solid waste. The wire tying head automatically swings away from the frame during the compaction process. During a tying cycle, the needles and the twister assembly are moved into position and the bale is tied. When not in use, it pivots away, keeping all tying components out of harm's way. The wrapping machine operating in this video is extremely fast. It has a special design rotating the bale 360 degrees and completely seals the bale in less than two minutes. This is important because the baler and wrapping machine operate together. The baler is not waiting on the wrapping unit, and the wrapping unit is not waiting on the baler. Wrapping refuse has numerous advantages. A wrapped bale eliminates litter during transit from the transfer station to the landfill. Odors, leachate, and vermin concerns are greatly reduced. Wrapped refuse can be loaded onto standard trailers, eliminating special equipment. Bales are easily stacked for storage or placed into the landfill, without need for additional soil for daily cover. Resident protests are neutralized around both transfer stations and landfills. Overall, wrapping may be the most cost-effective and modern means of handling refuse today.